is a virtual Pilates session the same as following a video? Not at all. And so you have to work a little bit more on the one towards you. Lift your arms up as you lift the chest. Yes. And press back, dive forward. Lift your arms up to the ceiling. Rotate. Yes. Open. Spread your shoulder blades wider and wider and wider. And again. Hey guys, I'm Sammy. I'm a classical Pilates teacher. And today I'm just really excited to show you how a virtual session with me is gonna be tailored specifically to your needs. So unlike the pre-recorded videos, my sessions are interactive and well personalized to whatever it is you need. We can use any Pilates equipment that you have access to, or we can just work on the mat with or without props, depending on what you have. I'll give you real-time feedback, corrections, and adjustments to ensure that you're really mastering the true Pilates method. And after watching the rest of this video, if you yourself are interested in your own virtual session, then go ahead and comment the word interested in the comment section below for more information. Let's get into the video. It's always in my head now with the lift your chest. I'm working and I'm like, lift your chest. So I get that a lot. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, down a little, right there. Perfect. Yeah. All right. Awesome. Um, anything bugging you? Um, tight, tightness, I'd say like across. And do you have a foam roller? Yes. So let's grab that to help open up your um, lower back. And so you have to work a little bit more on the one towards you. So pull towards you a little deeper and switch and switch. Inhale, switch, exhale, switch, inhale, switch, and pull towards your face, pull towards your face. Good, open your arms to the side. Now press back through a big vat of peanut butter and dive forward. Rotate your shoulder more. And then yes, uh, that way forward. Uh, yes, like that. Good. And lift your arms higher and higher and go down, 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 and then open and spread your back really wide. Spread wider with your shoulder blades. Good. And then from there, connect your uh, fists and row back right away and pull. Use your stomach, push your feet forward, open. Press back, dive forward, lift your arms up to the ceiling, rotate, yes, open, spread your shoulder blades wider and wider and wider, and again, go back. Beautiful, Sarah. Inhale, stick your legs out more. Stick your butt out now. Exhale, dig your chin and come up. Stick your butt out. Reach your legs to the wall in front of you. Yes, yes. Now reach your arms up higher so that they're parallel to your legs and roll down, inhale exhale, leave the legs there, go right back up, inhale, exhale, go for your swan dive, Natalie, flip your palms to the ceiling when they're reaching by your ears. Okay. Now let go, look up and lift your thighs to go. Belly button, lift your arms up as you lift the chest. Yes, and come back, beautiful. In line with your knees, so lower more. Good, and then pull the knees in as much as you can, keeping the heels in line. So they'll have to go down a little bit more. Yes, good. Now you'll press out to the diagonal, just like on that uh, foam roller, pull the stomach in and up, those lower abs. Good, and you're gonna go overhead. Good, you can put your toes onto the floor here. Okay, just as low as you can, bend your knees, bring the knees towards your ears and bring your heels closer to your butt now. Good, and then slowly take your spine down with control. Beautiful, feels very different on the mat, huh? Yes, I like, I like both though, have eyes like yeah. you. Try to keep your hip really still. Rotate up, rotate down. So when you rotate up, don't let your butt roll backwards. Imagine there's a wall there and you can't roll it backwards. Find that wrap of your shoulder blades. Go wide and around to come up. Good. Keep your arms up, go on top of the couch. Good. And then try to wrap your shoulder blades around more. Yes. And then come back, inhale and keep wrapping. Wrap the shoulder blades, wrap the shoulder blades. Good. Exhale, arms go up. Pull your toes backwards. Now look at your toes. Did one leg pull back? Yeah, right pulled it. Right, yeah, right. So then you're, yeah, so just try to be cognizant of that. Inhale, press, go over, and jackknife and flip your arms. Go, you shoot it up, hold it, hold it, hold it. Shoot up more, more and more behind you, behind you, behind you, behind you. Yes, and now flip the hands and go back. Beautiful. Okay, go ahead and pull it apart, inhale. Keep pressing through the pubic bone and top of your thigh and lift, pubic bone, top of thigh, really find the, the, yes, 
Exhale, pull the belly button up like you're diving into a pool, but from that belly button only. Yes, and again. So we're working proximal first. Both hands behind the right leg and your left leg will lower. Oh, okay, I get it. All the way down by your sides, roll your shoulders up and back. You are all done, Sarah, nice job. Oh, thank you, Sam. Job. Oh, that was great. Perfect start to my Saturday.